and I hope you guys have a lovely Christmas at Oh, I got tongue tied. <laughs>Christmas. Welcome to today's video. So I just got back home from my Nana's house and I thought let's continue on with this annual what I got for Christmas series because I actually really enjoy watching other people's what I got for Christmas so I'm just putting my two cents in there. This is what I got for Christmas this year and PSA I shouldn't have to say it but I'm not bragging. Christmas isn't about giving and receiving presents. It's about sharing love and happiness with your friends and family. So let's just jump right into the video. So I'll start with the presents that I got from my brother. So for the longest time, I have been wanting to have my own version of Cards Against Humanity. I remember when it first came out and you could download the PDFs from their website. That's what I did. I printed, not even kidding, 50 sheets of paper. I'm really sorry about that, mum. Literally 50 sheets of paper of Cards Against Humanity cards. Um, so now I have my own set. Thank you, Dylan. And he also bought me... It, the new 2017 version of It, the movie. Oh, I remember seeing it in the cinemas and it's just so amazing. I'm so in love with the story. And to continue on with It, I also asked for Stephen King's It book. Um, I've been wanting to read this for ages because, as I said before, I'm really in love with the story. I love watching the original 1991, I think that's when it was made, 1991 miniseries. I'm obsessed with the story, so I thought, let's read it. But look how thick this book is. That's crazy. But I'm on uni break now, so hopefully I'll have enough time to finish it, or at least start it. <laughs> so the other book I received is A Midsummer Type Stream by Louise Renison. So the author of this book actually wrote Angus Thongs and Full Frontal Snogging, which is one of my favourite books of all time. This is actually the sequel to and the book called Withering Tights, which I've read before. I think I was in year seven or eight when I first read it. Um, so this is actually about Jordan Nicholson's cousin. Um, what's her name? Tulu Lacassi. So I'm really excited to read this one because I haven't read the first book in a long time. So I'm really excited to read that one. Now this can't be a Kristen video without me talking or showing flamingos. So I received this flamingo beanie boot from my mum and dad. Yes, I know I'm 18 years old, almost 19. I'm still a kid at heart, so that's okay. I remember when these first got announced in August, I wanted my hands on one for so long and I finally have one. Its name is Gilda, I think. Yes, its name is Gilda. It's so cute. Just look at its cute little eyes. So cute. <laughs> the next thing I received from mum and dad, actually, it says it's from Santa, if you can see that, is basically the only present I asked for for Christmas. Um, once again, Christmas isn't about giving, but this is, when anyone asked me what I wanted for Christmas, this is what I said. I wanted a Carol King CD, most specifically the Tapestry album, because that's my favourite Oh, I can't get over how much I love Carole King. She's just my favourite singer-songwriter of all time. So I received two of her CDs. This one is a Carole King Tapestry, but it's live in Hyde Park. So this is a CD and the DVD of her performance, of her concert. And then this is her beautiful collection, which is her greatest hits. So I'm really excited to listen to these ones. I was really hoping for the record, but I haven't found it anywhere it's so hard for me to find so i think i need to go look in some garage sales and little op shops in my holidays <laughs> the next present i received from my mum and dad is this vs Sud diamond radiance straightening brush now i remember when these first came out a few years ago i was very spectacle about it because i have such thick and curly hair and when i do straighten it it takes about an hour to two hours just to straighten it so that's why it's always curly i never even bother so i thought this might be something fun to try maybe as a video who knows i know the trend's long gone by now but i mean something worth trying so i'm really excited to have my own little spin on this and see how it works out. <laughs> now getting back to the flamingos, I also received this Dangerfield dress with flamingos on it from my mum and dad. This one is called the Flamingo Dance Dress and it's in the colour black. So it is super, super cute. It's got like a love heart neck 
line and these very cute flamingos on the bottom you could also get it in blue but i feel like black just goes with everything so it'll just suit me a lot more and the last thing i received from my mum and dad is this betty boop sunshade for the car i reckon since i was about like five years old i remember going to car shops with dad and always seeing all these betty boop things for the car and i always used to say i'm gonna have a betty boop decked out car betty boop like little I don't know, just Betty Boop everything. So for Christmas, I also asked for like things for the car because, you know, adult life, you've got to be practical now. So I thought, sunshades. I mean, it was either going to be Betty Boop or Flamingo decked out, but Betty Boop is so timeless. You can't go wrong. So this one is so, so cute. <laughs> I can't wait to put this in my car and replace the frangipani one that's all faded. <laughs> The next present is also car related and I got this from my uncle and auntie and my cousins. So this is a flamingo seat car cover. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, when I opened my present, I just, I lost it because it's so cute. Like I never thought I could find seat covers, like flamingo seat covers for my car. So these are super adorable. Like look. Oh, I'm so excited. I need to tell dad to help me put these on my car right away so I can have a flamingo car. <laughs> Continuing the theme of flamingos once again, my same auntie and uncle also bought me a Morgan and Finch tote bag. I guess this is a beach bag sort of thing. This is actually the same pattern and from the same brand as what my quilt cover set is on my bed at the moment. So I'm a... <laughs> You can't go wrong. If you ever get me for a secret Santa or buy me a present, not that you have to, but <laughs> you know you can't go wrong with flamingos. They're always going to make me happy. <laughs> and the last thing my auntie and uncle got me were these Coca-Cola sockets. What do you guys call them? I call them invisible socks, but on here, oh, they're called no-show socks. But I know so many people that call them sockets. I call them invisible socks. Let me know what you guys call them. So these are really cute Coca-Cola ones. Very ironic because I don't drink soft drink, but Coca-Cola, it's a very cute little brand. Yep, cute socks. <laughs> and from my other auntie and uncle and my other cousins, I received a Maya voucher because Dangerfield don't actually have their own set of vouchers. And the only danger, or the closest Dangerfield to my house is actually in a Maya center. So this is perfect. That's exactly where this is going to. So thank you for this one. And I also received another voucher from my Nanna and Nanno, and this is for Priceline. Cannot go wrong with Priceline. Once again, this is another easy present to get. Priceline cannot go wrong. <laughs> so those are all the things that I got for Christmas. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Christmas spent surrounded by your family and friends. Hope you're staying cool in this very warm weather. Until next time, see you later, everybody. Bye. I hope you guys are having a Merry Christmas spent by your... Oh, I got tongue-tied again. <gasps> I can already tell this is going to be a long video. So, best suggestion. Grab yourself a gingerbread, some leftover roast, a cider. Just have a little snack while you watch this video. Because we all know after Christmas, you're going to be tired and wanting to have a nap. So, good. <laughs> I'm rambling. Bye. <laughs>